Hello my dear children, this is Kosalai from Brain Ignum Slekol International CBSE School. Today we are going to see a new topic, knowing our numbers, in that we are going to see about Indian system and international system of numeration. In this topic, we are going to see about how to place commas in Indian system of numeration and international system of numeration, followed by how to name a number in case of Indian system and international system. Before going into the topic, let us see with a small example. Okay, now we have taken an example of a number. In this number, we are going to see how to place a commas in Indian system and how to place commas in case of international system of numeration. First, we will see how to place commas in case of Indian system of numeration. In case of Indian system, we have to place commas from the last, that is from the left. We have to place after three digits a comma and then followed by two two digits. In case of Indian system of numeration, come on, let me explain once. From the last three digits, you have to place a comma. Followed by two two digits, you have to place a comma. But in case of international system, in case of international system, we have to place commas from the last after three digits, followed by three digits again. Suppose if you have one more number on this side, you have to place a comma after three digits here also. Again, I will repeat how to place the commas in case of Indian system and international system. In case of Indian system, from the last, after three digits, you have to place a comma. Followed by two digits, you have to place a comma. But in case of international system, from the last, after three digits, you should place a comma. Followed by three, three digits. Okay. Now, I believe that you have clear about how to place the commas in case of Indian system and international system. Now, let me see how to name a number in case of Indian as well as international system. We, from the childhood days, we have learned about how to name a number. We usually name a number by means of ones, tens, hundreds, thousands and it goes on. But coming to Indian system and international system, there is a difference in naming the number. Let us see how to name a number in case of Indian system and in case of international system. In case of Indian system, it is ones, tens, hundreds, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, ten lakh, crore, ten crore and it goes on. But in case of international system, it is once, tens, hundreds, thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, ten million, hundred million, and it goes on. Now, again I will repeat you how to name a number in case of Indian system. It is ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, 10,000, lakh, 10 lakh, crore and 10 crore. Come on children, take your note and note it down. And in case of international system, it is ones, tens, hundreds, thousand, 10,000, 
ஹண்ட்ரட் தௌசண்ட் மில்லியன் டென் மில்லியன் அண்ட் ஹண்ட்ரட் மில்லியன் சி வேர் த சேஞ்சஸ் அக்கர்ஸ் இன் கேஸ் ஆஃப் இந்தியன் சிஸ்டம் இட் இஸ் ஒன்ஸ் அண்ட் இன்டர்நேஷனல் சிஸ்டம் இட் இஸ் ஆல்சோ ஒன்ஸ் இன் கேஸ் ஆஃப் டென்ஸ் போத் த சிஸ்டம் வி ஹேவ் டென்ஸ் ஹண்ட்ரட்ஸ் போத் த சிஸ்டம் வி ஹேவ் ஹண்ட்ரட்ஸ் தௌசண்ட்ஸ் போத் த சிஸ்டம் வி ஹேவ் தௌசண்ட்ஸ் டென் தௌசண்ட் again same both the system both we have 10000 but in case of indian system we have lakh international system we have 100000 we have lakhs in case of indian system there is no lakh in case of international system instead of lakh we have it is 100000 keep in mind we never have lakh in international system it is 100000 lakh occurs only in indian system that is our system of numeration we follow the lakhs in case of international system we never follow lakh instead of lakh we follow only 100000 here it is 10 10 lakh and here it is million again we won't have lakh here instead of lakh we are having it as 10 lakh it is equal to million in case of international system of numeration and crore here it is 10 million 10 crore it is 100 million okay next uh take your note and note it down what are all the changes we have made here at the last we will have an assignment questions then it will be very easy for you to uh, refer and write let us see how to name a number in case of indian and international system let us take the same example example itself 8765432 here it is ones place this is tens this is hundreds this is thousand it is 10000 then it is lakh lakh 10 lakh and it is crore okay how we have to place commas in indian system from the last three digit next two digit again followed by two digit okay now we will see how to name this number it is 9 crore 87 lakhs 65432 it is 9 lakh 9 crore 87000 sorry children 9 crore 85 87 lakhs three digit after that followed by two two digits you have to place a comma how to name a number it is ones tens hundreds thousand ten thousand lakh ten lakh and crore it is nine crore 87 lakhs 65432 it is clear in case of indian system now let us move for international system let us take the same example how we will place the commas in international system from the last it is three digit followed by three digits again you have to place a comma after a three digits since we don't have any number we have stopped with as two digit now how to name this number it is ones tens hundreds thousand it is 10000 instead of lakh what we will have it is Hundred thousand million ten million. Now we will see how to name a number. It is ninety-eight million seven hundred and sixty-five thousand 
फोर हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी टू अगेन आई रिपीट यू वी वॉन्ट हैव एनी लैक्स और टेन लैक्स इन केस ऑफ इंटरनेशनल सिस्टम इंस्टेड ऑफ लैक्स वी विल हैव इट एस हंड्रेड थाउजेंड ओके सो वी विल नेम इट एस नाइंटी एट मिलियन सेवन हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी फाइव थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी टू सी नाइंटी एट मिलियन सेवन हंड्रेड एंड सेवन हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी फाइव थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी टू फोर हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी टू Again, I'll repeat. See how to place a comma in international system from the last after three digit, followed by three three digits. You have to place a comma in case of international system. Again, how to name a number? It is ones, tens, hundreds, thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, and ten million. So it is ninety eight million seven hundred and sixty five thousand four hundred and thirty two. It is clear. I believe it is clear, children. Now you will have five questions as an assignment while you are coming to school on the next uh, working day. Complete the assignment in an A4 sheet and submit to your concerned maths teacher. questions are enough in this three questions you place the commas in indian as well as an in international system separately and write their names in indian system and international system